go to Catholic schools, and we want you to know what it's like to be at a Catholic school. You know you go to a Catholic school when... The food you eat is horrible. You have to have your shirt tucked in. Always. Can't wear sneakers. Even though they're good for your feet. When we get older, our feet are going to hurt from wearing crappy shoes. Like these ones. Look, look. No support. Horrible. If we wore sneakers when we're about 90, we'll be better off. You put endless amounts of gum underneath church pews. You lie. A lot. You miss school regularly for multiple doctor appointments. This bitch. <laughs> you don't leave the house without a sweater. You've seen one too many self-tanning disasters. Oh, the cramps excuse does not get you anywhere. Nope. You wear yoga pants instead of dress pants. Your lunch monitor doesn't even clean the tables. You become friends with the priests and the sisters. Your principal never comes to school. You have sworn that you will never, ever send your kids to Catholic school. <laughs> you lie. A lot. And people will always believe you because you go to a Catholic school. You lie when someone asks you if you went to church on Sunday. You'll get written up if you're chewing gum during mass. If your polo isn't tucked in, you get written up. Almost every teacher is in on the student gossip. You sometimes forget what real clothes look like. Everyone knows everything about everybody. And if something happens at 8 in the morning, the whole school will know by 9.30. If you walk into a class a second after the bell rings, you have to have a good excuse. Or a pass. Parents seem to think you are a great influence on their child. You basically cheat on every test. Every test is done, like, as a group, pretty much. You fight with everyone in your class like they're your brother or sister. Because you've been with them since you were in pre-K. At one time, you have almost <laughs> liked your uniform. Almost. almost. You get kicked out for wearing pajama pants to school on a dressed down day. You hate your principal, and you know where he or she lives. If you're not wearing Sperry's, you're not socially acceptable at our school. And usually in our school, there's at least, like, 20 people that are related. And there's probably only, like, 200 in our school. You conclude that nuns are bitches due to lack of sex. You can cheat perfectly on any test. You don't know anyone in your class that hasn't cheated at least once. You'll probably become an atheist after you graduate. Mm -hmm.